Hey guys, so before I start the video, I just wanted to say ignore the way I look. I basically woke up like an hour ago, but I wanted to do this video because I need your help. And I just want to do this video because I want a video done. And I'm supposed to be up at 1. And it's currently 1.11. Oops. I need your help deciding if I should stick with my phone that I have now. I have the iPhone. Let me take this off for you. I have the jet black iPhone 7 Plus. And I currently have the iOS 11 beta on it. I don't know, the only reason why I'm making this video is because I'm not sure if, if my phone's gonna start going slow. And for me to pre-order the phone, it's in two days, so today's the 13th, 14th, 15th, two days, so I just need to, I need help. I don't know. Basically, I was going to get the 8 Plus if I was going to get any phone because, girl, I'm not paying a thousand dollars for a phone. No thank you. The 8 Plus is almost a thousand, but I'd get the 8, but I want the double cameras because I am obsessed with that, and I like the big phone. I have my computer pulled up right here. I'm going to start recording this screen, so it'll be like down here or something. Hopefully, it'll still fit like all my cases. And that one, actually ignore that one. Deciding either the gold iPhone 8 or the black one. So, um, once I'm done with this full video, let me know in the comments if I won't, if I should buy a new phone or if I should just stay with this one. And if you say I should buy a new phone, then tell me what color. I'm kind of digging the gold. Also, let me know what size I should get. 64 or 256. I currently have 256 and I've only used, I've used 28.4 gigs. But yeah, let me know that's the gold version. I'm really digging it. Or the black version. I like the gold, it's better than this gold. That is the two golds next to each other, and then this one is the black. Which it looks a little more lighter on the eight than the seven. All right, so it has the same screen, camera, has touch ID. The only thing has changed is that it's a different, a better chip, I guess, I don't know. And then it has wireless charging, which is awesome as well. Um, which I really like, think it's cool that it has wireless charging. The iPhone 8 Plus has a true tone display. I don't know what that means. The iPhone 8 Plus gets portrait lighting. <clears throat> I think that's the thing with the front camera. I think everything else is the same. Well, the back of the iPhone 8 has the portrait mode. Or portrait lighting, the front camera doesn't. Basically everything on the iPhone 8 and 7 are the same. Besides a couple things, iPhone 8 Plus less the same as 7 Plus. And this one also has fast charging where it says that it'll charge up to 50% in 30 minutes, which my phone, I have to charge with the like the um, giant Apple, I mean the iPad charger. When I'm in a rush, I charge it with my iPad charger so that it charges quicker. With the iPhone 8 Plus, it already has like fast charge, 50% in 13 minutes um which i think is kind of cool and which i will probably end up needing i don't know and they don't make a 256 in the iphone 7 plus anymore which is really weird but i guess it's so people will go get the iphone 8 front view and then the back view of the colors which i kind of like the black better but then i'm like i really like the gold i don't know 256 is 949. Okay, well the 256 is out of my damn range. That's how much a 256 is with my tax in my city. And then that is with the 64 gigabyte. And I would do like the month to month of paying, but that would go on our phone plan and I have to pay my mom that. And then the Apple one, I had to have a good credit or something, I think. So, so I'll probably get the 64 gigabyte, even though it's going down a lot in gig in memory or whatever. Let me know in the comments on what color I should get and if I should even get one if it's worth it. Because I don't want to get it if it's not worth it. Alright, so thank you in advance if you do help me. And that's what comes in the box. Earpods, the iPhone, the lightning cable, the thing you plug into the wall, and then the dongle thing for the headphone jack. So that is the whole video. Basically just me asking for your help. I'm obsessed with Apple products, someone send help. But yeah, I literally, how long ago? 
So I buy this phone. Literally yesterday was only three months of me having this phone. Way longer, it feels like. That's basically it. Sorry, this was just like a random video. Sorry. Um, so if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe below to see future videos. Subscribe below to see if I do an unboxing or not of a new phone. <laughs> All my social media is in the description. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys.